In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, one God, amen. Good afternoon, uh, friends, brothers, and sisters. Welcome again, another daily message as we continue our journey. Uh, maybe it's long journey, maybe people are feeling bored, feeling again down, uh, need some kind of uplifting, uh, and that's why we're here, just to share a message of hope, message of love, as we go through the daily church readings, through the joyful 50 days, as we are uh, still uh, struggling uh, with uh, conditions that probably never uh, went through before. Today's message, uh, as we've been doing uh, about the church readings and uh, faith, today we'll talk about the universalities of the faith, the universality of the faith. Uh, today's uh, passage is from the Gospel of St. John, chapter 10, 34 to 38, and particularly I will read uh, verse 36. Do you say of him whom the Father sanctified and sent into the world, you are blaspheming, because I said I am the Son of God. Do you say of him whom the Father sanctified and sent into the world, the universality of the faith, the faith that is for everyone, that faith that should reach everyone. But what does that mean to you and to me? Universality of the faith, uh, we'll uh, talk about three words real quick. Number one, it is uh, uplifting. Number two, it is uprooting. And number three, it is upbringing. What does that mean? It's an uplifting faith, faith during this time that we are struggling. We maybe we're down, maybe again, we are uh, 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 waiting for something to happen but we need to hold on to that faith as an uplifting faith this is all what we have just to submit to him as the one that's in charge the one and the only one that's in control and uh, allow that faith to uplift us to give us hope to give us something to wait for uh, uplifting faith most of all because it is faith in the uh, kingdom that we have by being united with him. Number one, it's uplifting. Number two, it is uh, uprooting. Uprooting means it takes out things. The faith that makes us actually look at ourselves and see what is it that needs to be uprooted from our hearts. Uh, we need to come and, and offer true repentance in order for that faith uh, to reach everyone. Uprooting. And finally, it is uh, upbringing as if it is dealing with a little baby that's up bringing him or her into being a mature full adult. Faith that will teach us, faith that will bring us from step to step as we move on towards maturity, towards the fullness of his image. Three things in order to really live the universality of the faith. Number one is uplifting, number two uprooting, and number three upbringing. Are you working on those three things or not? Let that faith uplift you, let that faith uproot the bad things from our heart, and let that faith uh, upbring you into full maturity to be uh, on the fullness of his image, to him the glory now and forever, to the ages of all ages. Amen.